Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, good evening. My name is Leanna Watt, and I am the principal here at Penfield High School. I would like to welcome you to tonight's performance. Um, for nearly 40 years, March has been designated as Music in Our Schools Month, and the purpose of that really is to recognize and bring awareness to the importance of music education in our schools. And truly, schools are, are the one place where all students who are interested have access to a high quality music program and instruction. And so um, we don't take that for granted. And pretty much everywhere I go, anyone who will listen, I share with them how both proud and impressed I am with the music program in Penfield. Um, certainly um, an incredibly talented staff and that doesn't go without the partnership of all of our families and all of the hard work and efforts from our students. And so I thank you very much for that. I hope that you enjoy tonight's performance. And with that, please help me welcome Mr. Brian Bricko.
Check one, two, there we go. Thank you so much. That piece has a little bit of a false ending. Apologies for that. Thank you, thank you so much, yeah. Um, so that piece, In the Bleak Midwinter, uh, is a wonderful arrangement, obviously, as you can tell from your program, by um, someone who has been very important to the band world for many, many years. His name is Robert W. Smith, and he's written original pieces of music for band. He's arranged numerous pieces of band. And unfortunately, we lost him um, at the very beginning of the school year in uh, late September, just last year, 2023. And I thought this was a wonderful way to kind of pay homage to him in all of the work that he's done for the concert band and wind ensemble genre over the years. So arrangement of Robert W. Smith, a wonderful piece of Gustav Holst there. Thank you so much. Um, and I just wanted to say before we continue on with our program, I made one little mistake in the program and I want to acknowledge that. So it's listed as alto saxophone. Our wonderful bassoonist, McKaylin Hart, is playing bassoon. She's not playing alto saxophone tonight, but she actually, she plays many instruments. She plays alto saxophone sometimes in concert band. She's playing bassoon this time. She actually plays flute in the wind ensemble as well. So McKaylin Hart's on bassoon. How about a hand for that? We have one more piece for you this evening, and we f found it very fitting, uh, kind of a metaphor for the changing of the seasons. You know, in the bleak winter we just had, and we have this piece coming up next called Sunburst, and it really, in my mind, it really kind of signifies this uh, new beginning, this spring starting to happen. So we're really hoping that by playing this, that we're kind of ending winter and we're getting into spring, and so we're hoping that the temperatures follow suit as well. Thank you so much for being in our audience this evening. Thank you. 
Good evening, and happy music in our schools month. My name is Henry Dean, and I direct Concert Choir, which whom you see behind me, uh, Chorale, Jazz Choir, and Uptown Express at the HS. Uh, Concert Choir is our 9th through 12th grade introductory vocal ensemble that meets every single day. We also have instrumentalists from Concert Band and Philharmonia that join us once a week to prepare for concerts. Um, this month is really special to music educators as we recognize the importance and privilege that we all have as a society for every child to learn and make music, regardless of who they are or where they come from. So it's my hope tonight that you'll take time to reflect upon all the opportunities that your child has to learn an instrument, play or sing in an ensemble, to perform for a public audience several times a year. Um, thank you for continuing to support your child's musical endeavors and the PHS Music Department. I'll now invite members of the concert choir to introduce our first piece. Hi, I'm Kiara. Hi, I'm Kaylee. And I'm Ava. Our first piece is Franz Joseph Haydn's Gloria from Helic Messe. Haydn wrote this piece while under Prince Esterhazy's patronage. Haydn's compositions have had an enormous impact on developing classical music. In fact, he was Beethoven's teacher. The translation for this piece is Glory to God in the Highest and on Earth Peace. Goodwill to men, we honor you, we bless you, we adore you, we glorify you. You will, you will hear our upbeat repetitions of glory and the soprano's high notes on the word excelsis meaning highest. Then you will hear us sing about peace with a warmer tone and a softer sound. Finally, you'll hear us celebrate with projected fanfares and call and response melismas. We hope you enjoy, Gloria. Hello, I'm Ben. Hi, I'm Alyssa. I'm Alan. Our next and last piece is Come to Me, O oh My Love by Alan Robert Petker. The text describes singing to express one's love for another. 
listen to how the first melody overlaps with counter melodies throughout the song and how the main melody is traded between each section. At the end, listen for the dramatic crescendo on the word love. Everyone has someone special in their lives, whether you have love for a romantic partner, family, friends, pets, or places. We hope you will reflect on how special they are to you and cherish the time you have together. We hope you ha enjoy the rest of the concert and have a wonderful evening. Excuse us, we had a minor uh, sheet music error. Be right back. 